Ted. A big guitar hotel on the Las Vegas Strip. Today, Hard Rock International presented its early renderings of its newly acquired strip property. Sasha Loftus joins us live from outside the Mirage, the future location of the new Hard Rock property in town. Sasha. Kirsten, we finally have a better idea of what this new hotel will look like here on the Strip. You'll remember earlier this year, Hard Rock entered into an agreement to purchase the Mirage and really completely change it up. Now, earlier today, the Nevada Gaming Control Board recommended approval of the purchase. Now, they need the Gaming Commission to approve it. That hearing is December 22nd. Hard Rock International submitted its application, including renderings with a design for the guitar tape shaped tower that everyone's been talking about. Those those behind the plan say their goal is to create a style similar to the other Hard Rock locations around the country. Now we spoke with some on the strip today to see how they feel about this plan. I do travel around a lot and there's just, I think there's enough Hard Rock cafes as is um, and it becomes too uniform. There are the trade-offs because you can hold on to the past or you can agree to move on to the future and I think that would be the Now, the hotel will have over 3,600 rooms and 174,000 square feet of casino space. Renovations also planned for villas, a private gaming room, event and meeting spaces. Now, the Mirage will continue to operate as normal until plans for the Hard Rock are finalized, and the Hard Rock itself is set to open sometime in 2025. Reporting live on the Las Vegas Strip tonight, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now.